The Demon King Demise, a deity who had conquered time itself, laid waste to much of the land, seeking to take the Triforce. The goddess Hylia gathered the survivors and sent them into the sky, allowing her to launch a full-scale offensive against Demise. She was victorious, but the land was severely damaged. Uncounted years later, the outcrop was to become known as Skyloft and its people came to believe the surface below to be little more than a myth. It is at this time that a knight candidate of Skyloft by the name of Link arose and was to take up what was known as the Goddess Sword, a blade imbued with the divine power of the Goddess Hylia. This sword was to be the focus of a portion of the young hero's adventure as he sought to gain the blessings of the flame of first Ferrari, then that of Nehru, and at last the blessing of Din to retemper it into what was to become known in later years as the Master Sword. Armed with the mightiest weapon in Hyrule's history, Link was to do battle with the Demon King. Before it could be struck down, Demise was to lay down a heavy curse upon Link and Zelda, one that proclaimed that for the rest of eternity he would haunt them, their descendants, and their souls forevermore. It was after this major battle that Skyloth's inhabitants returned to the land and that Zelda established the Kingdom of Hyrule. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to smash that like and that subscribe button as though you were Link putting an end to Ganon.